unpaid, overworked, a woman at home, mother. How much does her labour cost? She dwells in darkness, whom darkness does not know, whose body is darkness. The naked goddess has her head down and legs wide apart. From her womb springs a plant, straight and lethe, with its five leaves uprising and auspicious. The earth is the great uni. The woman's body in the Indus scene is the earthbound root, the fecundating source and sustenance. <laughs> the woman's domain was the dwelling and its environs, tilling the soil, preparing food, producing and raising children, weaving, pottery, hunting, fighting to protect the tribe drew men away from home. As agriculture developed, man laid claim to the plough, the cattle and the land as his private property. Surplus production was bartered. Women continued to cook and stitch only for her family. <laughs> The artificial division between productive and unproductive labour began here. Even weaving was taken away by men when the first mills opened. Cycles of menstruation, pregnancy, lactation. Woman's capacity to work has been questioned again and again. Love object, mistress, wife, daughter, given away in marriage, forced into slavery. Who wouldn't choose a richer master? The wife mother was enshrined. Mother Goddess, dehumanized, desexualized, condemned to sacrifices, yet taught to reach beyond the immediate. Women in India are at the same time free and inhumanly oppressed. Taboos on earning, performing in public, working alongside men are breaking down one by one. Part woman, part child. The menstruating body of the young girl transforms her overnight. Made responsible, yet restricted. Women have to develop an inner strength. Modern city life is eroding such primitive survivals.
ritualistic Aryans following clothes on matriarchal barbarians allowed women free participation in all social activities. Women were scholars, attended public discourses, could choose their own husband. Child marriage was unknown. Widows remarried. But with the giving over of her child into the clan of her husband, the beginnings of her slavery set in. The exclusive ritual of birth could never be shared by men. In retaliation, taboos were created around the symbols of production. Women could not approach the plough, the machine, the transistor, the car. need lots of light for the basement because basically I've kept the basement for the serious readings to have a sort of a peaceful quite even if it's so if it were quite dark it would be quite okay because if I provided artificial light what, about rainy season? what happens during the rainy yeah, season? Yeah, water you come and collect uh, around that because it's very deep around area. Where? basement where do you mean the yeah, I mean it's, of course it's a lower level than hmm. so water will come and collect where yeah, near the basement. Outside, you mean? Yeah, outside. Outside the basement. Well, yeah. that will be taken care of by the train. The reason why I've got a basement for serious reading and all that. Would you like me to tell you? Yeah, sure. Huh? Yeah, I was very happy. 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 I was very जी अगर में उसके लिए हम लोग इस्तेमाल करते थे खाना वगैरह खाने के बाद सब लोग मतलब लेटने के टाइम उसी में रहते चार पांच बजे तक फिर सब लोग बाहर आ जाते थे और ये जो हमाम है ये नहाने के लिए यूज होता था इसको गरम किया जाता था इसके अंदर तांबे की बहुत बड़ी-बड़ी चादरें लगी हुई थी तो एक कमरे से दूसरे कमरे में तीसरे कमरे में नहाने के बाद 
आया जाता था ताकि गर्मी कम होती चली जाए का तो जब मैं वहाँ पहुंची तो वहाँ बहुत पर्दा होता था तो मैं बड़ी घबराई मैंने कहा भाई अभी तो बोल का पर्दे बहस चल गई अब आगे क्या होगा फिर वो मैं बहुत डार्क कलर का काश्मी रंग का बरखा था वो उड़ती थी तो इसी तरह चलता रहा तकरीबन मैंने 12 साल तो बड़ा स्ट्रिक्टली पर्दा किया लास्ट ईयर जो आया तो मैंने कहा भाई अब इस बुरख को मैं ख़त्म करना चाहती और एक दिन मैंने उसको आकर को रख ही दिया पर्दे पे तो मैंने बहुत लोग सुने ही है तो बड़ा गुस्सा करें शुरू से ही ये जो तरीका था कि औरत के मायने हैं घर में बैठो घर संभालो खाना पकाओ बच्चों को देखो तो ये तो अजीब सा कम से कम मुझे तो लगता था क्यों ऐसा अंडर मुस्लिम लॉ द सन डज नॉट एक्सक्लूड द डॉटर फ्रॉम अ शेयर इन द फादर्स प्रॉपर्टी The marriage contract is advantages to both husband and wife, but local social conventions intervene, and women remain as oppressed as ever. कम से कम जिस सारी ज़िंदगी का सवाल होता है जानना तो चाहिए इसको। अब पता नहीं और लोगों क्या उपलब्ध हैं? शायद आजकल लड़कियाँ इतने आगे बढ़ गई हैं अपने पैरों पे जो खड़ी हो गई हैं कि शादी करना ज़रूरी है क्या? तो ऐसा नहीं सोचती अब बताइए मैं क्या बोलू First free women were the prostitutes, cultured, proficient, often companions of powerful men. Women acquired independence by giving up respectability. <laughs> The British brought an alien language, alien ways, new modes of transport, new social conventions, mainly through the initiative of men, Parda, Sati, child marriage disappeared with the advent of Western education. women took to the streets to demonstrate against british raj after independence many returned to their homes and housework a job with no time limits uncomputable in terms of money running a home bringing up children is hard work
a woman from the urban upper class escapes this tedium in seeking distraction without channelizing her energy. The long journey towards independence, emancipation through initiative, through awareness of rights and responsibilities, through knowledge, the sophistication of intellect, with a new sense of adventure into a new world. 